before uh, before we configuring the our Spring Boot application with the with the micrometer actuator and Prometheus and my matrix stations, and we need to be look for how can you configure, how can you install the the Prometheus and then and Gafana. Uh, Docker containers and how can you run the Docker container application? That's I already did it. Like here, the, we just simply uh, we simply just uh, write down the the run the Prometheus application. If you see the Prometheus is there, the uh, the Prometheus is there that you used. I just simply run the Prometheus. That's the Docker images. The Prometheus image is the latest term is used and the Gafana let the Gafana image. And yeah, that's the two. Two images to run the our uh, our application uh, the, to to run the uh, the Gafana to GUI and also the Prometheus GUI. So you see, we just simply uh, we simply run commands. That's like here. If you see the commands like that, so we have uh, so we, we see the the Docker run name is a Prometheus UI and the D and the port number nine zero nine zero and the and the Prometheus EML files is located and then you have a uh, the container path etc prometheus prometheus ml and this is the uh, is the prometheus is there then docker image they don't contact the from the local directory if it's not that local directory is the prometheus is there then it's uh, download the from the uh, docker docker hubs so it's very straightforward to run docker run name of the file name of the containers and the detach mode and the port numbers 9090 and then we pass like the where the our uh, Prometheus EML files. I will show you that one, and also the the image number, and exactly the same thing when you run the uh, the Kubernetes uh, in Gafana. So you can see we have a Gafana. That's very straightforward. The Gafana tools, Gafana uh, Docker run uh, detach mode. We can put it also the names that we already did that the Gafana. Uh, so you can put it the Gafana just name minus minus names and then those are new into the Docker and Docker Docker Compose or Kubernetes and just follow the my previous screen class or Google it to how can you run write down some Docker commands how it is look like how it is works so Docker run detach mode and then you put it the names and it port number three zero three zero and then it has a Gafana and Gafana yeah, image download from the internet that's we exactly exactly here the two images the prometheus image and the gafana image take the latest uh, latest image from the from the from the uh, docker hubs so after the running the application you see the application the prometheus application is is running with the zero uh, we are with the name what we are did just with the name 9090 and then as gafana application is running uh, with the uh, with the three three uh, three thousands the port number three thousand application so this is the, all the this is the and this is the one of the tools that I, we are using in the enterprise level application like uh, like uh, like like any enterprise level application docker desktops is good tools if you don't like to write down a lot of commands or uh, you, you can also use this the docker desktop tools it's a good tools with the windows system with the windows platform so that means uh, after after the running these commands, you can see the the all the all the all the Prometheus is running with the specific configuration of Prometheus UML files and the Docker and, the, and also the Gafana is running and is downloading the Prometheus with uh, containers the Docker image and all Gafana Prometheus and also the Gafana image and run the uh, the container. Uh, container out of the specific port. So we Prometheus is running 9090 and Gafana is now 3030. That's how exactly here is presenting the and uh, presenting the uh, the 93030 our application and that this is our definition of the of the of the of the the Prometheus matrix information how it is become well, as part the U definition in the files. So it has the, the time series information. Gafana, you see the Gafana is lacking, running the local host 9090, and it has all the the information, the configuration informations, and the as well as a possibility a different 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 QGUI options is there. The time series options you can also do this such a way. Uh, some 
some some metrics information the old information exactly that's a new possibility new GUI and new new things in this post possible they are still changing every day the the improve the prometheus GUI the metrics visualization or monitoring the your microservice application and then uh, so that means we we, we 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 run the we need to be run the our spring boot application first of course we need to be configured the application what we did already into the configuration i will discuss and then we need to be mm, we need to be run the the prometheus and the containers the docker containers with the specified port that's what we did here 9090 and then we need to be run the uh, run the uh, gafana tools gafana desktop tools to visualize the matrix informations the from the applications uh, from from the our Spring Boot application via the Prometheus. So I will show you later this part of the uh, presentation. This part of the how it is be handled, how it is be configured, how it is be monitored things, and that's I will discuss a little bit later part when I start the developments. So that means we 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 need to be run the our Docker images and the respective images or download the images, run the images, the Gafana image and also the Prometheus image, and then we need to be run the application the containers itself the, with the specific port numbers. This is the Prometheus port and this is the Gafana port. You can here you can stop the uh, the, the 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 containers and you can, you can run, rerun, and restart and delete the container. It's possible. And that's I say this is the Docker, Docker desktop is a good tool. So you can if you are working with the graphical way or graphical systems. That's what. So even though we can go to the in the console and the, in the command cell, you can do also this way. So let's let's write down some. Uh, some uh, some commands some docker so you can see the docker images some basic commands those are new uh, just 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 google it to get it the uh, how many images you see the all the images you see the our prometheus image uh, and also the gafana is and also the, our spring boot application images and see also the mini mini, uh, mini cube images that's i said the previous screencast was the based on the how can you deploy the application in the into the into the into docker and kubernetes cluster that was the previous screencast and that one and in the one that was the deployment process how can you deploy the spring boot application rest, rest based application microservice application with the docker and docker, docker compose based deployment that i already discussed about so you see that and you can check it like the docker processes how is the docker process how many processes running so of course it is running only the two or three processes you see the gafana process is running and also the and the uh, prometheus process is running you can also the uh, docker logs uh, logs information for the, each of the process that's how it is like like docker logs and the container it let's see the 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 configuration the log information from the from the gafana because i'm running the maybe one hour so it's all the logs information how it is to be done how it is be handled the, all the the all the visualization information matrix information sent and also on and so forth so it is the really really how the all detailed information about your 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 applications your spring boot application even though you can also present or you can visualize the your, your backend server also yeah, how it is being how it is being handled backend server for this case we are using the uh, using the uh, we are using the the PostGIS my database servers uh, database server to use the as a micro as a, as a database migration tool with uh, uh, with